Queen Street Crossing is a new multi-span structure across the Firth of Forth in Scotland. It forms a centrepiece of an £800 million investment that Transport Scotland are making to replace the existing road bridge. It's been designed very carefully to complement its neighbours. So here we are standing on the south cantilever deck of the new Queensry Crossing amongst what is a magnificent vista of bridges. Uh, truly amazing and truly unique um, anywhere in the world. In the background we have the fourth rail bridge designed by Baker and Fowler, a very strong and sturdy structure in response to the Tay Bridge disaster which occurred at the time of its design. Adjacent to it is the fourth road bridge built in 1964 and again it was a pioneering structure of its time. It was the fourth largest suspension bridge in the world on construction. Following investigations in 2004, the cables were found to be corroding inside. So back in 2006, Transport Scotland launched a 10-year plan to create a new crossing. It's a crossing that will leave a lasting legacy for the people of Scotland, day-to-day -day users, visitors and tourists. And it will truly be uh, an icon of beauty. So we're standing on the southern tip of the central cantilever. It's a world record breaking structure as it's the largest freestanding balanced cantilever structure ever built in the world. Our world record was temporary in the sense that on connection to its adjacent cantilever, the structure is now continuous and it's been held by temporary frames whilst the welding of the segments is finalized and completed. The next major milestone on the project is to connect this cantilever to the north cantilever we can see in the, the background. Once those closures are made, within the next couple of months, the whole bridge will be continuous from abutment to abutment and we'll move into the phase of placing the final finishes. Rumble are incredibly proud to have led the design joint venture over a period of six years on behalf of the contractors FCBC. The design joint venture being an amalgamation of Rambo, Sueco and Leonhardt Andra and partners. From the beginning we've pushed the boundaries to develop a competitive, high quality and efficient design. At its peak some 150 engineers work on this project from across the Rambo group from Denmark, UK and India. A project of this scale requires a whole series of services which relate to the design of the foundations, the bridge's superstructure, which includes the steelwork within that, as well as connecting roads and infrastructure, which all go to make this the feat of engineering it is. It is a world-class project. It's a 21st century addition to three centuries of bridge engineering across the fourth. I'm certainly very proud that we've played a major part in the creation of this unique project and really proud of the contribution that Rambol have made to it.